This is a cold biopsy forcep. It's used to take tissue biopsies and also to remove polyps. To open it, simply pull across the top and take out the forcep. First thing we're going to do is we're going to inspect it for any damage. Make sure there's nothing sharp on it that shouldn't be there. We will uh, uncoil it to make sure it opens and closes properly. You'll notice it has a handle. It has a cable. And it has the jaws here. These are called alligator jaws. Also has a very, very sharp needle in there. And the, the needle is so that you don't, uh, that holds the biopsy on there while you're taking multiple biopsies. But you've got to be very careful with it not to stab the doctor when you hand it to him. And so always hand it to him closed. Another uh, interesting part of this are these graduation markers here. Or some people call them in and out markers. Uh, there's three sets. The first set is about 5 to 10, 15 centimeters uh, from the very end. And that helps you to know when you're about to remove it from the scope. The next one is for uh, gastroscopes. So you know when you're pushing the uh, forcep into the scope, the working channel of the scope, when you get start to get to these lines here, you know you're starting to get to the end of the gastroscope. The next set of lines here are for a colonoscope. So as you're pushing us down the working channel of colonoscope, as soon as you start to see these lines, you'll know that you're pretty close to uh, actually uh, exiting the tip of the scope. At that point, you're going to uh, move the tip of the scope or the tip of the forcep towards your target area. Then you're going to open it and then you're going to push into the target area and close. Uh, but don't close hard, close gently at first until you're sure you have the tissue that you need or, or the polyp. Then the endoscopist will quickly pull it back. Uh, be careful when you're taking it out of the scope that you don't squeeze too hard on the handle because that will make, especially if the scope is retroflexed, it'll make it too hard to, uh, to remove. Another thing to remember is when the endoscopist has the cold biopsy forcep in the scope and he is trying to retroflex or getting to a difficult position, do not squeeze hard on the cold biopsy forcep because it will cause it to stiffen and when it stiffens, it makes it harder to bend the scope. So just a couple of tips and tricks. Uh, when you're finished using it, this is disposable. So when you're finished using it, place it in the proper uh, biohazardous waste container, uh, whatever is approved for where you live. And there you go. Good.